Uh, I'm Jacob Pauluk from Poland. We are sailing together with Marek Stanczyk, second time on this event uh, with Marek. We had some uh, puff conditions, uh, some uh, big uh, wind coming in and uh, I had a close meeting with Boom <laughs> while jibing, so uh, yeah, I, I got my <laughs> head a little bit injured. Yeah, and obviously it's been a pretty extreme day out here with the wind and the and the rain. But uh, we've only actually done two races. The first one was against um, the local team, uh, Fraser. Um, we had yeah, a really good race. We actually managed to black flag them. So uh, it was quite an exciting race, lots of penalties. And uh, it was good to take the win there and get off to a good start. I think the condition is pretty good, a bit shifty, but uh, a lot of fun with this wind. Um, not my best day, honestly, but uh, likely the guys were doing an amazing job to help me on the course and uh, we were able to, to win two races uh, out of three. Well, but definitely a little bit rusty. We flew in last night and just did an hour training session this morning, so not ideal preparation for this event and uh, definitely a lot of rust on board there. So we'll try and get rid of that for the next race and come back and get some more points on the board today. I think that's key. It's always the first day here is probably the biggest day. You've got to come out and perform straight away and it's always a hard thing to do. So you're either on or you're not. <laughs> uh, well, we, we didn't have a, the greatest of starts, a little bit rusty, but um, we were able to laugh uh, Bjorn on the on the beat and get sort of get control of of the race or at least get free and, and sail our own Winchester and Ian and the guys did a great job to sail the boat fast and we kind of got got ahead and managed to, to stay ahead so it was a nice first race for us we were a little bit sort of unsure how things were, were going to go with all the rust slowly filtering off us. No, oh, we're having good good time. Uh, we feel at home here in Bermuda. I guess we're going alright. We. I think we're going to find out a bit later today how rusty we are, but so far we've been lucky. Uh, too tough racing out there. Uh, been racing the Danes. We know what we did wrong with uh, in the match with Ben, and uh, we took the start as we wanted and uh, managed to get the right hand side. He actually pu pushed us to the right hand side, uh, but then uh, halfway up the beat we let him go behind us and uh, we misjudged the lay line there, so he managed to to uh, fetch the mark and uh, round it about one and a half boat length ahead of us. And that was the key moment in that race. We should definitely have uh, stayed on the right hand side of him. And uh, uh, it feels a little bit ba bad, but uh, we know that there are many matches to come and uh, we will learn from that mistake. So we had a fantastic first day of qualifying here at the Argo Group Gold Cup, the fifth event on the 2013 Alpari World Match Racing Tour. The format of the competition is that there's 20 teams and they're split into two groups of 10. First out today, uh, Group 1, and they've completed four flights. And coming out top at the end of the day was Adam and Opie on three wins. Second in the group is uh, Francesco Bruni on two wins. Um, and then this afternoon, we moved on to Group 2. And coming out at the top were on joint leaders on four points were Ian Williams and Ben Ainsley. Tomorrow, we've got the Battle of the Brits, first thing. Uh, so there's going to be a bit of fireworks there for uh, the leader of the group. Brilliant weather today. Started off a little bit, uh, a little bit rainy, uh, but the breeze came in up to 17 knots. Um, the sun came out later on in the in the day, and the wind dropped off a little bit. Looking forward to some great weather tomorrow, and uh, continuation of qualifying. <laughs>